morning floss tube welcome back it is our floss tober series where we are unboxing the black needle society's trick-or-treat halloween countdown box yesterday we opened the fabric for our fourth kit so i'm pretty sure today we're going to be opening the flosses that's been the pattern with all the other kits so it's day 24 it's very exciting let's dive right on in yep it is Oh my gosh, and there are a bunch. All right, so it looks like, yep, all DMC. So I'll show you what I've got. We've got 422. I'm sorry if these don't focus well. 728. 3046. Mm -mm -mm. Two. Zero two. One of the newer ones. Zero four. I like that gray. I also really like this. 470. That's a fun green. 829. 03. 167. 310. Can never have enough of that. 3865. And finally, $37.99. So lots of grays with some green and yellow and a black. I feel like it's like a spooky house or something. It's definitely like a scene. There's not a person for sure. Okay, so it also includes a card in the box. So each day we scratch off a pumpkin and it gives us more information about the item that we opened. So today it says thread pack by DMC, called for by the designer, fibers for your fourth kitted Halloween project. So let's see if I can get some or all of these to show against the fabric. There we go. There we go, that's pretty good. So I'd love to hear your ideas of what you think this kit is going to be because I do not know and I don't even know who to begin guessing as far as designers we've already had Bendy Stitchy we had Autumn Lane Stitchery and we had the Witchy Stitcher so who else is there like who else do you think would be designing for Black Needle Society I'm really excited maybe Frosted Pumpkin they're kind of muted colors for a Frosted Pumpkin but we'll see um, yesterday I did help my sister move. She's all settled into her apartment, which is really, really exciting. She's a lot closer to me now by about 20 minutes. So she lives just 20 minutes away from me now, not 40. And she's like five minutes from my mom, which is really nice. Um, so it was good. We had a ton of help, so she didn't have to move around too much or lift anything because she's pregnant. So we didn't really want her doing that. So it was, it was good. I'm exhausted today though, but I'm trying to shake it off. I've got to go grocery shopping and clean the house and run some errands. So just kind of a lazy Sunday here, taking it easy. Um, yeah. So I will be back tomorrow. It looks like we'll be opening the chart because that's usually been day three of opening kits. It's been fabric floss chart. So I'm expecting to open the chart tomorrow morning on Monday. And then Tuesday morning, you keep an eye out. I'll also have my weekly floss tube update with a special guest. So that'll be really exciting. You don't want to miss it. And in the meantime, if you have questions, reach out to me on Instagram. I'm at Cepha Sparkles. Um, you can leave a comment below. That really helps me out so people find my channel. Or you can email me. I'm cephasparkles at gmail.com. All right, guys. Have a great Sunday. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Do something spooky and Halloween-y today. Bye!